Hey guys, it's Jeff, and today we're checking out the Amplify Alien Mesh Wi-Fi 6 router system from Amplify. Um, full disclosure, Amplify did send me over this unit for review, but also full disclosure, I have been using their product for quite some time now. This is their Amplify HD Mesh Wi-Fi system. I upgraded to this unit um, about like one and a half to two years ago, and so far I've had no issues with it. So I actually reached out to Amplify to take a look at the Alien unit simply because I wanted to see what improvements have been made and also see what Wi-Fi 6 is all about. So let's dive a little bit deeper into the Amplify Alien and see why it's such an improvement over other routers out there. Okay, so this is the Amplify Alien all unboxed. And as far as the setup process goes, it's pretty easy. It's basically plug and play. All you have to do is plug in your Amplify router uh, to power, and then you go ahead and plug in your ethernet port and it will do the rest for you. There's no um, other things that you need to do. And just in case you do get stuck with any of that, um, they do have a support guide through the app, or you can go to their website and they have um, support through that as well. Now, as far as the uh, setup operation for maybe like a second unit for the mesh system, all you have to do is plug that unit in. You don't need to plug it into, um, you don't need to plug in like an ethernet to the back. All you do is plug in power. Um, the original router will kind of connect uh, to this mesh point and just say, hey, do you want to use this as a mesh point? You just click yes on the touch screen and uh, you're all set to go. So it's pretty easy setup, but as far as anything else goes, um, if you have any questions or anything like that, they do have a very good support system through their website. Now let's talk about the insides of this unit. Obviously it looks very, very cool on the outside. It looks very high tech, but there's a lot of hardware inside which is actually more impressive than how this looks on the outside. Now, I did mention this does have Wi-Fi 6 capabilities, so um, this is a Wi-Fi 6 router, but it also has backwards compatibility to Wi-Fi 5. So it has a, a Wi-Fi 5 chip um, that has a 5 gigahertz band, and then also a Wi-Fi 6 chip, which has 2.5 and 5 gigahertz bands, respectively. So um, you do have uh, some options there. Um, what is the difference between Wi-Fi 5 and Wi-Fi 6? Well, Wi-Fi 6 is actually an improvement um, in speed and distance. Distance. So um, you'll get faster speeds over Wi-Fi 6, um, you know, between the router and your device. Um, you, you'll also be seeing like a distance factor increase. So essentially you can use your Wi-Fi 6 compatible device with this router and the distance between them can be even farther because that signal is a lot stronger. So Wi-Fi 6 will essentially go through like walls. It will go over longer distances more um, thoroughly than Wi-Fi 5. But the biggest improvement besides the speed and kind of the distance factors is actually in efficiency. So um, basically what happens when you go from a router to a device, um, the, all the data that's sent in between are actually sent in packets. It's not like a steady stream. So these packets are actually packaged more efficiently uh, in Wi-Fi 6 protocols. So essentially the communication from device to device on Wi-Fi 6 um, will take up less power on this device and also your receiving device as well. So if you own like an iPhone or a laptop or anything like that and you're streaming, you're actually going to be getting a more efficient uh, you know, system in streaming. All the data packets will be a lot more efficient, which will lead to better battery life on your devices. So um, this is a pretty well-rounded upgrade, Wi-Fi 6 that is, over Wi-Fi 5. And it's definitely something you guys should be looking at as we move on into 2020 with all of these new devices coming out that are Wi-Fi 6 compatible. Now, there is a link down below to kind of like a more thorough explanation of what Wi-Fi 6 is. I gave a very elementary version of it. So that is in the video description down below. Go ahead, check out that article. It's definitely a good read on Wi-Fi 6. Okay, so besides Wi-Fi 5 and Wi-Fi 6 capabilities, this also has a 2.2 gigahertz uh, CPU inside. You might be asking, why does a router need a CPU? Well, Amplify added a CPU simply because it wants to handle uh, more connections at a higher speed. So what this means is I can go ahead, stream Netflix, like a movie on Netflix. I can be playing video games um, online and also maybe like uploading content to YouTube all at the same time with without any connection type uh, kind of lagging, stuttering, or um, you know having any drops in speed. So this will provide speed to several different connections um, and provide quite a high level of speed. So that's why there's a CPU involved and um, that is actually one of the main reasons as to why I got my original Amplify system because it handled speed so well across so many devices. 
Now, I also did mention that this is a mesh system. So essentially what a mesh system means is um, you have an original unit and then a second unit to provide coverage to maybe the rest of your household and or business. So uh, for me personally in the household, I have two simply because with the old HD system that I had, I actually had three points. So I had the router and then two mesh points and that provided coverage to um, the entire household um, over 3000 square feet of, um, of like a two story Story household. So I had very good connection with the old system. I noticed with this system that I went downstairs and I did some tests just with one um, router setup, not the mesh point. And I was still getting connection at the farthest point of the home. And um, at the farthest corner, I was still getting connections. Now I'll throw up a graph of kind of the connections I was getting for this router and then some other routers that I tested. And the results are actually very stunning. Um, even with one system at the farthest corner of the household, I was getting way better connection than what I would be getting um, even halfway, um, you know, with a different router set up. So this is a very good system, but if you want to maintain um, speed throughout your entire household and you own a pretty good household size, um, like I do, like over um, 3,600 square feet, you may want to consider getting two of these so that you maintain that uh, really good connection speed throughout the household. So guys, that's uh, all about the hardware inside. If you have any comments, questions, or anything like that, uh, please comment those in the comment section down below. But let's talk a little bit more about the unit itself. Obviously, you see here it has a beautiful touchscreen at the front of the device. And basically, this is where you can see all your information about the device itself and what's going on. You can see uh, your currently active speeds of the device, your current connection to the internet. Um, you also have uh, different tests that you can do, speed tests, for the unit and it also provides more information about what's going on um, of your internet usage. So this is actually a very uh, kind of good system up front where you can operate that all through touch. But what's even better is Amplify provides you guys with an app as well to kind of um, control your device completely. So what this app does, it, it gives you complete control over the Amplify system. Uh, you can change the SSID name of your router. Um, you can go ahead and update your router, um, you know, software updates through this app. Um, you can control your guest network and you can also um, use this as a device for teleport. So what teleport is, is if you have the app on your device, um, you can teleport into your home Wi-Fi system should you be away from home. So what I use this for is actually accessing files um, on my um, kind of hard drive when I'm away from home and I can act as if I'm connected to my, um, my own Wi-Fi at home. I won't have to go through like any special servers or anything like that. So that's really cool. And I can also log in with VPN as well. So that connection is very secure. So um, teleport is definitely a good feature with the app and something that I've used um, for a very long time now. Now, as far as any other features go, any other notable features, I think one that is really, really cool is actually a kind of like child protection feature. Um, basically what you can do is you can set your children's devices all in one group and then that group will be limited on time on the internet. So essentially you can uh, go ahead and turn off their internet connection at 9 a.m. or 9 p.m. and then turn it back on at like 7 a.m. Um, so that they don't have connection to the internet uh, throughout the time when they need to maybe be asleep. So um, that's really cool. Um, there's some really cool features located within the app. So I definitely encourage you to go ahead and check those out uh, should you go ahead and pick up an Amplify system. But there's so much that you can do with the app. It makes everything um, about operating this device and kind of managing it so, so easy compared to maybe some other uh, systems which are all done through the computer and maybe a little bit confusing. So guys, that is the Amplify Alien Mesh Wi-Fi 6 system. Of course, if you if you have any comments, questions, or anything like that, please comment those in the comment section down below. I'll be sure to get back to you guys as soon as possible. But guys, if you have any issues with your current router, maybe your speeds are not as high as what you're paying for uh, through your Wi-Fi connection, or maybe you're getting drops in connection throughout your business place or um, maybe your home as well, um, you definitely need to look at this as an upgrade choice because this will provide you with the best experience uh, you know, possible on Wi-Fi that you can get out 
out there. And with the improvements to Wi-Fi 6, um, I'm sure that you'll be enjoying those improvements for quite some time. So guys, thank you for watching our review on the Amplify Alien. If you like this video, definitely give it a like. Also get subscribed and hit that notification bell button if you want to get future updates on content um, like any reviews or anything like that that we have uh, you know, being released in the future. So guys, again, thank you all for watching and hopefully I'll be catching you guys in some upcoming content. Peace.